like it hurts. So that's what it would sound like, you know what I mean? We are observing wildlife. The elusive Rocky Mountain elk. Dude, that one has a collar. Yeah. What's up with that? You know what it is? They track the populations, I think. It's actually birth control. I'm not even close to kidding. I talked to really? the about it, yeah. I swear to God. It is just birth control. Because they're so overpopulated. They wow. have to start doing something about it. And because you can't hunt here, they had to do birth control. So there we have it. If you see a collar on an elk in the wild, it's birth control. Isn't that neat? Dude, check out the fox. Holy crap. There's a bull elk. I guess they're called bulls, aren't they? Yeah. Look how heavy it is. Like, what? Are you following them? Well, my mind is blown. Working on my recovery up here at uh, what was it called? Cub Lake. Cub Lake, the Rocky Mountain National Park, in Colorado. Today, my recovery involves becoming one with the cup. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, duck. <laughs> Your thoughts and prayers mean a, they mean so much to me. Thank you so much. Take care. <laughs> We're making friends. He wants our lambus bread. <laughs> One small bite is enough to feed a blue chicken for months. <laughs> Rhett doesn't always feed blue cheese, but when he does. <laughs> They like it perched up on the wood. <laughs>